Okay, close your eyes if you feel safe and comfortable to do so. And begin focusing on your breath, your inhale and your exhale. Imagine that with each inhale, you're able to breathe in peace and relaxation. And as you exhale, imagine that you can release any stress or tension in your body. Inhaling peace and exhaling stress. And now take a moment to scan your body and see if there are any areas of tension. Allow yourself to notice where in your body you might be feeling some tension. And if you notice any areas, can you relax the muscles in that area? And just allow your body to release some of that tension. In fact, relaxing your whole body, starting at your feet, the bottom of your feet and your toes. Can you imagine the muscles in your feet relaxing, releasing any tension in your calves, letting all tension evaporate out of your body your upper legs and your torso area. And every area that you bring your attention to, notice how you can help that area to release any tension that might be there. Focusing on your chest area, your heart area. Can you release any tension that might be there? And your shoulders, maybe you raise your shoulders and feel the tension and then you let go and notice how good it feels to relax the muscles in your shoulders and your neck. And now take a moment to bring your focus to your eyes and the muscles around your eyes. Can you relax those muscles? in your forehead, relaxing the muscles there as well. And now all the way down from your upper arms to your lower arms, to the tips of your fingers, letting go of any tension. Take a moment to imagine waves of relaxation going back and forth through your body and working out any other tension that might still be there, starting at the bottom of your feet, going back and forth, all the way up your body, all the way up to the top of your head and back down again. Just allow yourself to be completely relaxed at this moment. We're going to take a moment to do a guided visualization, imagining yourself one year from today and thinking about the area of life that you chose, the area of life that you want to be more in alignment with your truest and best self. So allow yourself to imagine yourself standing in front of a long and interesting hallway. And there are 12 doors in this hallway. And as you stand there, looking down the hallway, you notice that some doors are on the left, some doors are on the right, and each door has a number on it. The door closest to you is labeled with the number one. Each number represents a period of one month of time. So that when you begin walking down this hallway, with each step you take down the hallway, you will be taking one step 
away from the past or the person you are today and one step closer to the future where your future self is already living as his or her best self, most authentic self in this area of life that you've been focusing on today. So allow yourself to imagine that you begin walking down the hallway slowly, taking one step at a time, passing the door with the number one on it. Pause and notice what color is the hallway? How is it decorated? Notice these things as you pass the door labeled number two. What material are the doors made of? Passing the third door, walking deeper and deeper into and towards where your future self is already living as his or her best authentic self. Passing door number four. What is the energy like in this hallway for you? Passing door number five and six. Halfway there, continuing to walk deeper and further further and deeper towards your future self. Passing doors seven and eight. Are all the doors the same color? Continuing down this hallway, passing doors nine, 10, 11, and now imagine the hallway ends and you're standing in front of door number 12. What color is the door? Can you see yourself in your mind's eye reaching for the doorknob and opening the door? As you walk in, you can see your future self busy in whatever area of life you chose. Here he doesn't notice you. It's almost like you're able to be an invisible witness to your future self. As you inconspicuously are an eyewitness to your future self in this area of life, what is he or she doing? If you had to guess the emotions that your future self is feeling, what would you say they are? What does his or her surroundings look like? What do you like about what you see? What is the energy in this room? As you're taking it all in, suddenly your future self notices you and your eyes meet and a big smile spreads across his or her face. With a warm gesture, you're invited over to where your future self is. And with love and kindness, your future self takes your hands into his or hers and tells you they have a message for you. And so as I say these words, imagine that they're coming from your future self who is looking directly into your eyes with warmth, acceptance, and kindness. And they say, I am so glad to see you. I want you to know that in reference to this area of life that you're currently struggling in, I want you to know that thanks to your hard work and your perseverance and your dedication to yourself, I learned to have different thoughts in this area of life. 
I learned to experience different emotions, more positive ones. And I finally learned to let go of the old story that kept us repeating more of what we didn't want and what we didn't deserve. Because of your tenacity and your strength, I learned to uproot the old beliefs that someone else planted within us. And I began planting more empowering beliefs. And as a result, I'm creating the life that we always wanted. I know that sometimes right now, you feel like no matter how hard you try, you feel like you never get to where you really want to be. But I'm here to tell you that sometimes the changes begin so deep inside that we don't realize that we're shifting because the external changes follow afterward. And so I'm here to tell you that I am so grateful for your hard work because I am now creating my life instead of reacting to it. And I have you to thank for that. You mean so much to me. I know that at times it's hard and it doesn't feel fair to have to work so hard at things that should have been normal if we had had a different experience in our upbringing. But I am so grateful that you saw that I was worth putting the energy and effort into. So thank you. Thank you so much. I love you so much. You mean so much to me. I am so happy with the life that I have now, and it is all thanks to you. And so I want to tell you some things that you did that were most helpful for me. Okay, so now your future self is going to explain to you the steps you took starting today to get to where he or she is one year from now. So I'm going to be quiet as you listen to what this message is from your future self. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. <laughs> 